I need to stretch this thing all the way here I cannot use the extend command I need a new command which is stretch gotta be on the modify because we're modifying an existing object so it's right here stretch so let's use it and what it does is basically it stretches objects so if I click on it following the instruction it says select objects so if I select this object let's see what happened so I'm gonna press enter and it's saying specify base point so I'm gonna pick this point over here click and it's saying specify second point oops as you see it's moving my object instead of stretching it so let's cancel that because I don't want that cancel hit cancel or escape on your keyboard and let's try it one more time stretch from your ribbon click now the problem was that we selected the entire object like this but for the stretch command to work it needs to be selected in a special way which is the window crossing selection so if I click once and then I need to include the piece that I want to stretch so I need to include it like this so se select objects specify opposite corner so I want to specify here click and then select objects so that means I need to press enter again again from the command line specify base point so I need to stretch this with precision so I can snap to this line so I'll click here click and then specify second point as you can see it's now stretching only this part and then finally I'll click here like so great and see the stretch command is very straightforward you type S for the shortcut and press enter you then click once twice press enter click once and twice again to stretch this part if we want to stretch the other way around again as enter click click enter click click and done however this stretch command technique is not enough if we're working in a complex project like this architectural elevation the reason stretch is so powerful here if we undo is because if you only move the window using the move command you'll see that you have to fix the rest of your drawing we don't want that that's why stretch command is so powerful as a bonus tip for the AutoCAD stretch tips remember to use the previous transparency command whenever you want to select a previous stretching for instance instead of select again my window I can simply say S for stretch and then P for previous enter and one more time enter to accept that selection so which stretching trick you didn't know let me know in the comments below